YouTube, Dawson Ryder here with a very quick bit of King Oger Sentai news about our first look at our two new auxiliary mech for the series. It's a little bit outdated news. I planned on getting this out like the day or two after it came out, but there was a lot of uh, Dom Brothers coverage and news coverage to get to, so I apologize about that with the finale and the movie and all that. But I wanted to talk about these real quick because I had some fun thoughts on them. I mean, I guess they're not that fun. You probably shouldn't watch this video, it's very mid. But anyway, so the first two auxiliaries are a pill bug, a rolling little mecha here, and then you also have a gatling snail. And I have to say, like, they're going to be coming out in spring. So we don't, as of this video, I don't have, like, an exact date or month for you, but they're going to be coming out in spring, you know, our first auxiliaries, which look, um, they look almost more akin to, like, a Ninja Storm Hurricanes or locked and drop little weapon accessories. You know, I guess a lot of auxiliaries are weapons, and kind of like Jojo ones, too. Like, they look like smaller ones. But anyway, these two were funny because, like, neither of them necessarily hit that button where I'm like, oh, man, I really love these designs. They're really cool. And yet, I really kind of appreciate them in context with, like, the insect theme. Like, the idea of a pill pug, like, roly poly type of one is just kind of adorable and unique and something we really haven't gotten before, at least that I can remember. Um, also, I really like the snail one, though. Like, this, a snailing, snailing, a snail gatling gun sounds kind of cool. Didn't we do something kind of like that for the original uh, dino charge zords? I think it was more like a, a mollusk or whatever. I don't know animals, but it was like a. Thing. I don't know, but the idea of a snailing gat snailing keep saying that snail gatling gun is just kind of cool because it's taking something kind of silly and teaming it up with something kind of cool and it kind of very works in a toku mecha -y way. And there's something kind of endearing about the design of the snail mecha that I kind of like. Honestly, about both of them, like I don't think they're out my absolute favorite. Like these are super cool designs, but I really dig the concept of them. And I think some of like the auxiliaries have potential to be like these really fun creative designs, which is what I really like about these. Is I think they're just kind of these creative and fun designs based off of the insect concept. And you know, I don't know if I necessarily want us to be overloaded with auxiliaries because we know that a lot of them might fall by the wayside as the series goes on. Definitely one of those things where like, I'd be curious to see them come up with more designs, just with different types of bugs and see what kind of innovations they can have. Kind of like the mecha version of, I like to see, you know, uh, a bunch of different suits when we have like a suit design I really like. And I like to get a mini ranger series or a mini rider series when I like the design principles to see like, oh, what can they come up with next? This is kind of like that where like I like the idea of like oh what kind of cool bugs can we come up with where we have these cool weapon hybrid ideas or maybe some like niche niche bugs you wouldn't think of using so yeah these are pretty cool I'm actually kind of looking forward to getting these and seeing what else we get uh, you know as of this recording the the toys are just around the corner so I'm excited to get our first wave of King Oger toys and seeing that but what do you guys think of our first auxiliary mecha are you excited by them do you like the looks of them um, what kind of like interesting bugs would you like to see get made into auxiliaries for this series let me know in the comments as always until next time don't forget to like comment subscribe and climb the steps and ring that bell so you get notifications for my videos Dawson Ryder signing out